In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can bring your Office 365 profile picture into an application that you're building on Power Apps. So I get this question all the time. Let's go ahead and dive in and see how it's done. Okay, so we're now here in Power Apps. All I've done is just create a Canvas app in tablet mode and we're ready to rumble. So before we go throw images on here or anything like that, well, we need to connect to a data source. We need to go get you know, a profile image from somewhere. So to be able to do this, what we need to do on the left-hand side is go to data. And now we have what we call connectors. And connectors really just allow us from our Power App to connect to different data sources, whether that's from things like SQL or whether it's an Office 365 user. And that's what we're gonna do right now. So right here we have Office 365 users. This allows us to get all sorts of information from who their manager is to what location they're at to no, you've probably guessed it, their profile image. So we're gonna just go ahead and select that. And here, if you've done this before, like I have, you can see it already has me there and has my email address saying that I've already connected. If you're new, you can do add a connection and then it's gonna just give you a quick blurb about it and you can do connect. I'm just gonna go back to the connector and then just select the connector that I already have or the connection that I already have. And now we can see it actually shows us, look, this is in your application. And if you don't want it there anymore, you could go ahead and remove it. All right, so now we have the connector. Let's go ahead and throw an image onto our canvas. So to add the image, all we gotta do is go to the top ribbon, choose insert, and then go to media. And then from media, we're gonna choose image. This now brings a sample image into our canvas. So I'm gonna just blow that up so we can see this a bit easier. So now we have our sample image, we have our connector to the Office 365 users. Let's go ahead and use that connection to pull in our user profile. So we're gonna go up here to the top to this function bar. I'm gonna delete out sample image, and then I'm gonna start typing in the connector's name. So Office 365 users. Once I do that, we can actually see that I've done this before. So now I can do this dot user photo v2. So let's go ahead and select that. So now we know that we're trying to pull out the user photo, I'm gonna go do this by email. And to do that, I'm gonna do user, and then I'm gonna pull the property for my email. And when I do that, it already starts telling me, look, this is the email that it's gonna be using, which is absolutely correct. That is my email address for this account. So once I finish that, what we're then gonna see is it's gonna bring in our Office 365 user profile. And that's all there is to it. You can blow this up and play it and see it in all its glory, but that's it. So I look forward to seeing what applications you build by bringing in your user profile straight into Power Apps. And if you've enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time for another video.